Developing tonight, Denver police are looking into three shootings within 30 minutes of each other overnight. Two people were killed, four others hurt in those shootings. This is a map of where this all went down. The first happened around 12.30 this morning near South Cherokee and West Arkansas. A juvenile was killed in that shooting and another was taken to the hospital. 16 minutes later in the Montbello neighborhood, a man was shot and killed outside a home near Carson and Maxwell. Then around 1 this morning, three people were shot outside the High Street Bar near 38th and High. And businesses near that first shooting near Cherokee and Arkansas say a warehouse in the area is often the location of late night teen parties. Now, police aren't saying whether those events are connected to the shooting, but others say it's highly likely. Denver 7's Amanda Del Castillo reports. People describe the area surrounding legacy traffic management as industrial. One that wouldn't normally attract crowds. A lot of people liked that this place is kind of out in the middle of nowhere and not too many people are around. So after learning about today's early morning shooting that killed one male juvenile and sent another male to the hospital. We're getting calls on shots being fired from there. Many instantly thought about the teen dance parties. <laughs> they say are hosted at this warehouse. We had no descriptions. Only just teenagers, 40 of them, males and females. A source giving us this flyer, saying these parties bring teens to the area at least twice a month. Another post online inviting 14 to 19-year-olds to 1390 South Cherokee Street. They're in high school, um, definitely in high school. We're in high school, you know, sweaters and everything. They're definitely underage. Many say that hasn't stopped liquor bottles and beer cans from littering the area after parties. We see liquor bottles all the time, new new liquor bottles all over the place, up and down this alley. We reached out to Legacy Traffic Management and called the number we found on the party flyer. We haven't heard back. We also asked police if they knew about the warehouse parties. A department spokesman saying records need to be reviewed. And do you feel safe here? Well, I didn't until <laughs> this morning. Reporting in Denver, I'm Amanda Del Castillo, Denver 7. If you have any information on this shooting or the other two, please call Denver Police.